Hi, my name is Diane Schuster. In this video, I'm going to explain how to deploy a Cozy Rock trial license key. This will enable you to test your SSIS packages in an environment that simulates your production environment for 30 days. You'll be able to kick off your packages using the SQL job agent. I'm only going to cover the parts of license deployment that are unique to using the trial license key, so you should also watch one of the other license deployment videos on this web page. Choose the appropriate one to watch based on whether your server has access to the Cozy Rock license server or not. Those videos have a lot more information related to deployment of the license key, such as what to do if you don't see the license application on your server and what permissions need to be set. The first thing we need to do is open the license application. So we go to Start and then All Apps. And then we scroll down and find Cozy Rock SSIS Plus and then we click on License. And you can see it already filled in the machine identifier. And now for Licensee, we'll just type in Trial in all capital letters. And then we click on this button, which will request the license key from the server. And we get an error message saying the trial license key has expired. You may or may not get this error the first time you try to use Trial as your licensee identifier. If you do get this error, then send your machine identifier to support at CozyRock.com and they'll notify you when you can try again. Now I'm going to show you what it looks like when it's successful. So we do the same thing. We go to CozyRock SSIS Plus and select License. And now we'll type in Trial again in all capital letters and request the license key from the server. There you can see it was successful. And it gives you the expiration date, which would be 30 days from when you requested the key. And that concludes this video.